To set up Fiji Wings Polarity, go to the Fiji Wings Polarity web page and download the zip file that contains the program. You can also download an example file that we'll use in this tutorial. When you launch VG Wings Polarity for the first time, transfer the downloaded file to the Applications folder. And in the Applications folder, rename the file Fiji as Fiji Wings Polarity. When you launch it the first time, you'll get a warning and you'll need to go to the Systems Preferences and then to Security allow that file to be used. That will allow you to launch Fiji Wings Polarity for the first time. So open the sample file. And we'll show several of the tools that are useful. You can add black and white arrows to the sample file. and overlay these on the original sample file. And clearing that overlay away, you can add color arrows to the sample file. And overlay those arrows on the original sample file. You can fill the shapes with color by clicking on Color Fill. And again, overlay these on the original sample file. You can perform nearest neighbor analysis to identify regions of polarity difference and highlight these in red. You can add individual black and white arrows by selecting shape, clicking OK, and a black arrow will be added to that location. And you can add color arrows to a shape by selecting a shape, clicking OK, and then a color arrow is added to that location. You can add arrows manually by clicking here, selecting an arrow of a certain size and shape, hitting OK, and then adding it wherever you want it. Finally, we use this example file to show color fill length. This tool colors the longest shapes in red and the smallest shapes in purple and every shape in between.